I'm fantastic. I miss you. I haven't seen you in a long, long time. How are you? They just told me that it's been five years since I've been in that studio, which is very surreal to me. It does not feel like it's been five full years. No, it seems like a long time, but I didn't know it was five years either. That's a long time. Are you living in New York now? I'm living, um, I kind of go back and forth between LA and New York. All right. right. Now, yeah. Well, when yeah. you're here next season, I, I hope to see you in person because it's, it's going to be my last year to see you in person here. I know. How do you feel? Congra I mean, congratulations. Thanks. Because that's got to be like an exciting. Yeah, it's going to be. Know, a, yeah, it's going to be a very celebratory the next phase. Yeah, there's another phase. Yeah. yeah. I don't know what I'm going to do. Yeah. I know Andy's got a job already. People are worried about him. <laughs> um, <laughs> so uh, I, I, I hear, uh, you know, how people like to talk about where people go. I heard you went to a Lakers game last week. Are you a hu Have you been a basketball fan for a long time, or is this new? This is a new, uh, a new thing for me. I mean, I've always loved basketball. I watched The Last Dance with Michael Jordan, you know, the Michael Jordan documentary. Yep, yep. A and that just, something flipped in my brain and body. And I was like, this is the most incredible sport. So now I'm a, a, a next level Suns fan. I'm oh. from Phoenix. Oh, so, so yeah. So you have to be you know. where you're from. That's your, your, your team. You have to. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> So that means you're for the Suns over the, over the Lakers? Oh, very, very, very much so. Yes, very oh, much so. That's a shame. OK. <laughs> oh, is it? Is I don't it? know. I understand, because I'm a, I, I'm a Saints fan, because I'm from New Orleans, but, and, but I'm yeah. also a Rams fan. So when, the, when Los Angeles was playing New Orleans, that was a tricky one for me. It's complicated, yeah. I know. But I, I, um, I'm, I'm all sons all the way, and we've tied it up, and tonight's another game. And there's the home court advantage going on, you know, because it's in Phoenix. So Go. I don't mean to brag, but uh, <laughs> sons are yeah. doing pretty well. Well, <laughs> OK, then, fine. <laughs> um, now, is this, have you, have you been out and about, or is this like your big fir first big thing that you've done in a while, is go to, to the game? That that was my first big event, mm -hmm. yes. But you have, you're now, you, you've gotten both shots, so you're all good. I'm all good. Good for I've you. I've gotten both shots, yep. That's, did you get six? Pfizer, baby. Uh, all right, <laughs> uh, Moderna for me. Um, <laughs> did you get sick on the second shot? You know what, I didn't. Oh, good. I didn't, which is, which is a rare thing, I know. Did yeah. you? Yeah, I'm, no, I'm getting my, uh, I'm getting Friday, I'm getting my second shot, and everyone says you get sick, oh, but some people no. don't get sick. Yeah, but also, you know, 24 hours as opposed to the kind of nebulous, scary yeah. world of COVID seems, you know, yeah. you know you'll get through it quickly. Yeah, yeah. No, I had COVID, so I understand. I, I've oh, sort of, God, I, you did have COVID. Yeah. I'm sorry. It's OK. Look, oh, no. it's, it's been a wonderful year. Um, so uh, <laughs> listen, so <laughs> speaking of that, there's always these fake stories going around. There's a great story about you uh, with the Spice Girls. You have to explain this. Yeah, well, the story, I've been told that the story is, I broke my shoulder in, uh, in June of 2019. And we were supposed to start filming Cruella like August of, two, or maybe even July of 2019. And um, I broke my shoulder in two places. But for some reason, the story became that I broke my shoulder at the Spice Girls concert that I was on somebody's shoulders and fell and broke my own shoulder. And that's just not, it's not, it's not. How, how does that come up? And first of all, I just want to see oh, you no. on someone's shoulders at the Spice Girls. I, like, I wasn't on anybody's shoulders. I, I, I'd already broken my shoulder. I couldn't get on anyone else's. Right, right. Um, no, I broke it the night. I was supposed to go to the Spice Girls concert in London and I did go, but it, the night before, Someone had like a little house party nearby, and this was 2019, pre-COVID, so you know, people could all be together and, and mingle. And I uh, was on, so it was like a waxed floor in this house, and I slipped, and my arm went back behind me, and I, and I broke my shoulder. And then I went to the Spice Girls concert the next day and wore one of those little, those little, you know, cuffs that they, well, there it is. You can see. Yeah. See, I'm wearing that little cuff. Yeah. And I didn't know yet that my shoulder was broken, and well, it turned out. It oh wow! You went. You didn't yeah. know your. Sh How do you not know your shoulder's broken? It seems like you'd feel that. I oh, know. Well, I was in England, and so they did an X-ray, and they were like, "There's a shadow on the X-ray." <laughs> well, what could it be? And we were like, "I gotta go to the concert." They were like, "Come back!" So I came back the next day. 
and I found out about my shoulder. They didn't really talk that much like a little witch. Uh, yeah, it does. For the, it does. For the story, it's more fun if they're kind of like Right, this. right. It yeah. does sound like somebody was stirring something that was yeah, yeah. smoking and then... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, hey, Emma, I have to take a break, um, but uh, don't go anywhere. We'll be back. We're back with Emma Stone. Uh, so uh, you have to tell everybody about Cruella is, first of all, the reviews are great uh, for the movie, for you. The movie is fantastic. You're fantastic. Um, I think people know, but this is, a, this is a different story. Tell everybody what this is. This is, uh, well, it's a, it's a bit of an origin story. It's kind of a reimagining of the, of the beginning of Cruella de Vil. So she is a young woman named Bestella. You see her kind of from birth. And then as she develops, uh, you see that she has kind of another side to herself that goes by Cruella. And you can imagine what yeah. happens next. <laughs> yes. Um, <laughs> And Emma Thompson, who is, by the way, just a fabulous person. I love her so yes. much, but she's fantastic. Um, was it confusing, the two Emmas on the set? Did one of you get a nickname, or? <laughs> it did. It's a good question, because we, we have had a lot of different nicknames in our time together. There's been Emma T and Emma S. There's Thompson and Stone, which I love because it sounds like Starsky and Hutch, like we should be back to back on the movie poster, kind of like looking yeah. at each other. With it, you know? yeah, with but a gun like it, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, and then, and then my real name is Emily, so sometimes Emma and Emily, but, you know. There's, yeah. there's many different variations. No one called you Boo-Boo? <laughs> sometimes some people call me Boo-Boo. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I would have called you. Um, we have, I don't know if Emma talks about it a lot, but we have a bathroom dedicated in Emma's honor um, because, see, there it is. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's, it's the Lou. It's her Lou. Um, do you have anything named after you? Has anyone done that for you? Um, no, I don't, I don't have anything named after me. And now I'm, you know, really sad about it now that I've seen that plaque. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, well, now... I'm devastated to not have my own Lou. You, you, you know what? We knew you would be what? sad about it, and I don't want you to be sad. That's not what we do here. We make people happy, so we're going to fix it. Take a look in this bathroom. <gasps> look what you have. Oh, what is it? It's what a, is it? It's a paper towel dispenser. It's your <laughs> very own... <laughs> Thank you so much. I'm such a big fan of paper towels. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> this is perfect for me. Everyone uses them when they're in there. I mean, not one person is not going to look at that and think of you. That means, that means the world to me. I can't thank you enough. Yeah, well, we knew it would. Listen, <laughs> I hope to see you soon. Uh, Cruella is in theaters and on Disney Plus with Premier Access now. And uh, you're fantastic in it. I hope to see you soon.